my name is Anthony Mann. I work for the Organisation for Economic Cooperation and Development, the OECD in Paris, where I head up the team responsible for vocational education and adult learning. And at the conference today, I was unveiling a new report from the OECD on career guidance. And what that does is um, take stock of the evidence and provide new analysis of the PISA data, which looks at the way that career aspirations are very much conditioned by people's social background, by their, by their social class, by their gender, by their, their migrant status. And in the absence of, of an intervention, we find a lot of social reproduction. And so there's a really strong case for career guidance in terms of both the efficiency of an economy, of allowing people to end up in parts of the world of work, navigate their way towards them, uh, uh, um, towards areas where there is real demand for, you know, for labour, but also this point about equity. It's, you know, it's just fair. You know, we need to intervene to make sure that everybody gets a fair crack of the whip. And so you know, we talked about what makes for good career guidance, we talked about what the evidence is of the difference it makes, and we talked about the crucial, the essential um, involvement of um, employers and people in the workplace, including trade unions, in that process. Uh, this conference is a, is a fantastic opportunity to bring, to bring together a community of interest of, of, of people who are uh, um, deeply involved in, in practice, in policy, um, in research, from two broad areas, from people who are interested in apprenticeships and work-based learning, and people who are interested in schools and, and, and more career-focused or work-related learning. And you know, these two communities have far more in common, um, perhaps today, than, than they have done in the past. And there's a, there's, a, there's a really great opportunity for synergy between them and learning between them. And I think that's what's happened over the last two days.